y'all so today's video is going to be a travel with me vlog stay tuned for this video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and yeah subscribe um don't mind my lace i'm in the rental car now getting ready to um go to a few we'll run a few errands for like last minute stuff Ooh. I want to just swerve into the freaking thing. I was just running the last, some last minute errand. Oh, I'm back home. I was um, laying down for a little bit. Then I did somebody here like an hour ago. I just finished. Um, Yeah, that's really it. That's all I got going on for real. I'm trying to debate going to work tonight because I got another client at 830. And it's 7 o'clock right now. So it's like, I could really go. But I got to get up at 7 o'clock in the morning to go um out of town. But I'm going to be sleep on the road so it's like should i go it's always should i go like i ask myself this all the time i should just be like go i got my bags kind of packed right there yeah my stuff kind of packed i gotta find my shoe my other shoe so i can put that in there but yeah stay tuned hey y'all so i just woke up at seven o'clock i'm already dressed i need to put some I need to put on some face moisturizer. Make sure you have some young co-workers. He needs some McDonald's. And I'm going to pay already for his plum. I'm about to give y'all a tour of our little condo thingy. So when you first walk in, this is the bathroom. Recute, recute. And then the first bedroom on the right looks like this. This is my sister's suitcase. So then you got the kitchen. And then the living room. Like literally the ocean is literally right there from our living room. And this is another bedroom. I'm pretty sure it's the master bedroom. And this bedroom has a bathroom in it too. And you can see the ocean view from this window in here. So we're finally here chilling on the um balcony. We're gonna leave later to go to the outlets and to dinner. So stay tuned for that. Yeah, I think I need to change my hair to the middle part. Cause I didn't put the edges right here. Oh, uh, we're about to leave. Ooh. What's it giving, y'all? What's it giving? I like how this thing got this right here. So my phone is held up perfectly, like really good. So yeah. All right, y'all. So this is what we eating. It's called Captain George's Seafood Buffet. Yeah, see what it's time at. See what it's time at. It's four. I think we just need to wait for her. Yeah, it's getting fancy. I don't even know if I can record it here, so hold on. So we're sitting down at the um, restaurant now. All right, y'all. So this is my plate. I'm gonna show y'all the buffet or whatever. They got a whole bunch of stuff with. I got crab, shrimp, crawfish, black mussels, corn. And that's all I got for right now, but they got everything at the bar, like fried chicken, macaroni, like a lot. It's like a good All right, y'all, so I'm eating this again. And I got an ice cream cone. So they got crap. We're back from eating. I wasted this stuff on my clothes, so I can never wear this outfit again. 
freaking garlic butter. But anyways, I'm finna get ready to get in the shower because that's all we doing today. Like we got here kinda at like, what time was it when we got here? Five. So, you know, it was early in the evening, really. So then we went to go get something to eat, went to the gas station and stuff. Really came back home to chill for a little. Well, can't say everything to chill for a little bit. Then we uh, went to go outside to eat. But right now it's like 10 o'clock and the girl is tired and I'm finna take a shower and go to sleep. So I'm gonna see y'all. What's up, y'all? It's day number two. And I'm dressed and ready. I just woke up not too long ago and I put on my clothes. And now we're about to go to um get breakfast. It's like 10 o'clock in the morning, but we're about to go get breakfast. So, peep. We're gonna do a little fit check. Little fit check right quick. Oh, I'm in the kitchen right now. Ooh. All right, so I'm just wearing this graphic tee, oversized. I tied it on the side, black jean jacket. And I got on these leather tights, patent leather tights. And I'm gonna wear my, uh, I don't know if I'm wearing my Converse or no, the boots. But yeah, y'all stay tuned for the, today's vlog. My light is super good. But yeah, y'all. It's really nice so far. I like the vibe. It's giving um the view. Like, hold on, y'all. Let me show you the view. It's really giving. It's so bright out here. Y'all, this is what we're eating up for breakfast. It's called um I don't know what this place is called. I think it's called National House of Pancakes. This is what we eating. I got some homemade fries, red lemon waffle, bacon, eggs. Oh my god, what that is? Crab omelet. Crab meat omelet. Bacon omelet pancakes. Yeah. <laughs> Boardwalk. Oh, the lighting is this way. So we should really be walking back towards the other way. It is giving, um, what's going to get Oops. I don't know what we're going to do, but we're walking the boardwalk right now. Everybody out here with their fur babies. Somebody give me a fur baby, please. That's it. Yes, ma'am. Let's play that song. Please, no. Look, get in my video. Fuck it. I'll put you on my vlog. Because every other time we'll be like, no, don't put me in a vlog. We live. This vlog. Come on, you gotta turn this way so you get the good angle. That's you just look. Okay, let's do it again. <sighs> Mom, give me a I got this jacket on. How you gonna say hey? standing behind my head anyways i got this jacket on because it's cold by the beach y'all y'all know it be more colder by the water so yeah but i'm gonna walk to it because this is what it looks like and it's really people out here in this water it's windy like it's cold like it's kind of chilly so i don't even know why they even in the water okay y'all so it's later and we're at a restaurant it's called Giant. I don't know what it's called, but we came here yesterday and we're back here again. So I'm gonna show y'all all the stuff they got. It's just a lot of people in here, so I'm gonna try to record. Okay, y'all, this is my first place. I ain't gonna get nothing for real, but. Number two. The crab is gone. 
third or fourth. I remember. What's up, y'all? So, just got back from eating um dinner. I'm about to take my clothes off and take a shower because it is now. Let me show you what's happening right now. Wait, that that's just gonna conclude all of this trip because this is our last day. Our last night, we leave early in the morning, so that's not gonna be really nothing. That's really gonna be the end. We should have did a cooking video in here or something. Yeah, right, we're gonna go home in the morning. I'm probably gonna go to tomorrow, is Sunday. I gotta go back to work. <laughs> I got to go back to work. Like, a lot of probably like, where this girl been? I ain't been going like consistently, consistently because my car but your girl back in her car so i'm gonna be out there like every day and i'm trying to be working because on my friend's birthday next month and then y'all know i'm moving in a couple months because i was gonna move in february i had my apartment had my deposit pay had everything had the money to move in all that but i just wasn't ready so now i'm waiting so july because i feel like that's when i'm gonna be like ready Hey y'all, okay, so it's two days later. It's Tuesday. Um, today I'm going to work, but um what time is it? 2 16 right now. I'm about to go to the dance store. Finally about to go to Lick. Cause I've been wanting to go, but I just ain't ever went, I guess. But I'm about to go to Lick and um then after that come back home and then fix my hair or change or whatever. I just got finished doing my client hair at eleven thirty. Just finished, so now I'm about to go to the dance store. Use the left two lanes to keep left. I just pulled up to lick. It's raining so hard. It was raining the last time I came up here. Okay. <laughs> so I got this outfit from lick and I got this one. And I got that one. And I got some pasties. So. Pink. On the way to work, I'm on the way kind of early today because I want to start back going to work early and not so late. <clears throat> so yeah, um, excuse this lighting or whatever. It's my first day back to work after my little vacation, whatnot. She little two day vacation. I'm today is Tuesday. Um, I skipped the day Monday because it was raining really bad yesterday. Like, it was raining all day. So I was like, mm, I'm not going to work. Update those outfits I bought. The black outfit, I hate it. Like, hate it. I need to find some way. Because I get my outfits from the dude in the club. And I like when I get my outfits from him. But I need to find somebody like that I just get my outfits from because everybody don't be reliable. They don't always have them on hand. So yeah, I need to find somebody that either make them or have them and have some that's like small girl friendly because sometimes them dance outfits that, that be one size, they be fitting the thick girls and I am not a part of the BBL community. So, I need my stuff to be extra small. But yeah, if y'all got anybody or know anybody, drop them in the comments because I'm looking. Plus, I'm looking for somebody to um, customize me a dance outfit for my birthday. So, y'all already know what's finna go on right now. I'm finna get my stuff ready to get out the car. A little minute. Not gonna lie. I hope all my lights is off. Cause y'all know we got Chloe back or whatever. So what's up? Chloe. I knew the lights was on. She act like she couldn't tell me. My car ain't even beep or make no noise or nothing. Ooh, y'all the ground wet and I got on Crocs and I just got my feet wet. 
Oh, my feet are wet. Oh my God. Girl. Got my body on my water. I'm at work. It's like nine o'clock. It's not much people in here for real. But it's a little bit. I'm trying to get up on the stage. So I just got home. This is all I left with tonight, Tuesday night. It's probably like one something or 200. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Wait, no, don't welcome back to my channel. Y'all already here. It's the next day. Um, Today is Thursday. It's nine o'clock in the morning. I'm up early because I didn't go to work yesterday. So I got to sleep early. Right now I'm about to go to Dunkin Donuts. I give me some coffee. I'm gonna go to Walmart or Target. I don't know. I haven't decided yet to pick up some stuff. Today, I'm gonna be running some errands. So, running some errands and going to work. So, I'm just gonna take y'all along with me for today as well because it's gonna be a week vlog. So, yeah, y'all stay tuned. <laughs> I'm back home I'm about to make a wig with this hair right here that somebody sent me well that my cousin sent me for me to make her a wig i just bought this um wax warmer it's electric it's so cute. So I'm home, finna take a shower. So freaking tired. This is all I left with tonight. Um, I didn't count it yet. I don't know how much it is, but I'm guessing it's around 150-ish. But yeah, Thursday night, this is what I'm leaving with. Yeah, so this is what I got from when last time I been to work. Tuesday? Yeah, Tuesday, Thursday, because I ain't go Wednesday. 
or a Monday. So yeah. It's Friday. I'm getting ready to run some errands right quick. I have to ship this wig that I made um, yesterday. I woke up kind of late today. So I was tired from last night, like so tired. But today is Friday. I don't think I'm going to work today, but I am going out tonight. So I'm going to bring y'all with me. Over there. We just pulled up to Midtown Bowl. Oh, Oh, okay, that looks better, but now my eyes look cross eyed. <laughs> that was it, just to say that, bitch. <laughs> 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 I don't know what this is, but I'm gonna show you. So, so we're walking to the car, I don't know why. <laughs> Oh no, y'all, hold on. Like, where are we going? Oh, oh, my we're not gonna race in Chloe. Where are we going? Chloe not getting right. Where are you going? Where are we going? Nigga. Big time I want to inspire in the city. It is the next day. I'm finally awake out the house. It is four o'clock. I'm about to go to my wife's appointment right now. Last night was fun. I didn't vlog much because we didn't do much at the um, bowling alley. It was like a little kid back or whatever. I was sleep all day. Well, I woke up and then I went back to sleep. So, yeah, but today is Saturday, y'all. And we're gonna be going to work today. Leaving my fave store. Can y'all even see it? I know y'all ain't want to see me going there for the 50th time. So I just got back from the hair store and getting the wax. I bought these lashes so I can try to fill in mine. Well, I already put one right here. I just needed like two in the front because somebody wanted to do this heart swoop. I don't know if it looks like a heart or not. Just put up to rumors. I need to put on my lip gloss. Oh, I changed my hair. I kept the heart, but I put a swoop. I mean, not a swoop, but um i put a ponytail i put a ponytail Top it off with some lip gloss, and you good to go, girl. Y'all, it's so cold outside tonight. I don't know why. Like, it feel like Antarctica out there, and it was just hot earlier in the week. Like, it was just hot, and now it's freezing. Oh First thing you said, I don't know if it's me and Raven finna split this bag. Hey y'all, so huh? Like technically we're supposed to leave later. Like we're supposed to leave at 4:30, but he said that he's not doing it. We're not leaving. Okay, y'all. I'm trying to get some good food. This is my outfit. Cute. And somebody was like, girl, you need just a cut. I be cutting the strings and I wash my clothes and shit. But I was just coming on here to tell y'all that time goes for it. So when it turns 4 o'clock, it's going to be 3 o'clock. And we lost the hour of work. Like, no. Uh, I just left work. I'm at Crystal's now getting me something to eat. It's 3 21. I'm so freaking tired and hungry. Like, it's ridiculous. We lost an hour of work today because y'all know daylight savings is over. Or did it start? 
I don't know. All I know is it's gonna get darker later. I should have got there earlier, like I said, but I didn't, so. But it's fine. Um, I think I did pretty decent, I don't know. Cause y'all know tip out be really killing me, but yeah. Um, I had to change my hair today. And I gotta tell y'all, I gotta tell y'all story time about how I got into it on my hair page because somebody said I scammed them. Okay, so I'm back home. It is the next day. I did not get my money last night because I was too tired, like way too tired. Okay, so last night, first of all, it was straight, but it was too many people in there. Like, it was way too freaking packed. Somebody put a 20 on my stage. Per. And I think I got this on the bar. I don't know, but we're going to put my big bills aside. Because I be getting lost. I be putting big bills in there sometimes with my money and be counting them as ones. Don't do that. I didn't count myself a couple times having some fives in there. Putting fives in the money counter. And the money counter counted as a one. And then when I have, when I put my money in a rubber band, it's fives in there that I didn't count it as one dollar. But anyways, um, yeah. Let me tell y'all how last night this man gonna tell me. This old, old man, ugly man, like, you're old enough to be my dad. He talking about, I sat down, I was sitting down, he gonna say, oh, how you get how you getting tired of making money? Like, if you don't leave me alone and let me take a break, like I got on these heels, you got on your regular shoes, your regular clothes, my feet hurting. And plus the time went back an hour yesterday and I was dumb tired. I don't know why. Like I was so tired. When two o'clock came, cause when two o'clock came, it changed to three o'clock. So we lost the hour at work i think they closed at four i don't know i left because i was like it's too many people in here i walked around a couple times when nobody spending no money for real. i probably would have made more if i would have stayed well i know i would have made more if i would have stayed but i was way too tired plus i had a client in the morning i just finished her um not just but i had two clients early like i had two early appointments so i just went ahead and left um, but let me give y'all a story time about how, what I was talking about in the car, about how, um, um, a lot of people came to my hair page and was coming in and was saying I was scamming somebody and I need to send her deposit. Like, y'all, they was going crazy. I'm going to put the comments up on the screen. I woke up one morning, not even one morning, I had came from work and I seen one person comment under my um, picture on my hair page at like two o'clock in the morning. It was like oh don't book with her she's a scammer and i'm like okay it must be somebody trolling one of these little hating little girls because they always be making fake pages like that's not the first time somebody that comments on weird stuff under my picture from a fake page and my job it was a it was a page that had zero posts so i was like okay you got zero posts and five followers i'm not finna go back and forth so i woke up in the morning my comments was blowing up i'm gonna put all the comments right here so they were saying stuff like, oh, you ugly girl, you need to send that girl her money. And I'm like, I'm talking to them. I'm like, who y'all talking about? Who is scamming? Like, who y'all talking about? Tell me who said I scammed them. Who said I took their deposit? Like, what's going on? Show me the girl at, like, where she at? So somebody went an appointment with me, appointment with me by the name of, well, I'm not going to say her name because she literally have nothing to do with it. But I was so mad at her because I was like, Okay, she booked an appointment and then she canceled it the same day, but she sent her deposit. So I was like, why would she cancel her appointment if she sent her deposit? Because you know, normally if you, if, if somebody book an appointment and they don't send their deposit, now times out of 10, they're not gonna come. Like they're not serious about the appointment. That is why I charge a um, deposit so that people don't be playing with my time. It's only $10, but it goes towards the service, but it's a deposit. So she booked an appointment, canceled it the same day. So, you know, deposit is not refundable unless I cancel or something happens like on my end, then I will refund the deposit like every time. Like, I don't have no problem with giving people the deposit back if I cancel. But if you cancel or you don't come, 
you're not getting the deposit. When she canceled the appointment, she had, I mean, her all her contact information erased out the system. Like, and she had never booked with me before, so I never had her number, her none, her email, nothing. So I'm mad. I'm like, this girl telling people, oh yeah, yeah, look at the heart. Anyways, I'm like, I'm mad. This girl telling people I'm scamming her. She canceled her appointment. I didn't even cancel her appointment. She never even texted me and said anything. I didn't cancel her appointment. She did it on her own. Like, I did not take this girl deposit or her money. So, they going crazy. We going back and forth. I posted on my main page. The people from my main page was coming under my hair page. Clapping back at the people. So, it was this girl. This TikTok influencer had made a video on her TikTok. Basically saying that somebody... She put an appointment with the girl, and the girl ended up um, saying that she couldn't do her hair the day that the girl booked for it after she paid a $50 deposit or something like that. So, and she never gave the girl the money back. So, that's what everybody thought she was talking about me. But what happened was the girl, the original style that she was talking about, she had changed her Instagram name after the girl made that video about her because I guess people went to her page because the girl on TikTok got like, 4.5 million like likes all together y'all know how on tiktok it um show all the likes so yeah she got like 4.5 million so she you know got a lot of followers so of course people was like when she when she found out the girl when the people her followers found out who took her money they went to her page trying to bash her i don't understand how that helps like anything but that's what it was doing but it had ended up I had ended up making a post on my hair page. I'm not saying her name. But y'all was so mad. I was like, I'm going to beat this girl up. Like, I'm going to beat her up. Whenever I find her, she better not let me see her. She been, they better not let me find her Instagram because I'm going to beat her up. Like, why she want to play with me? Why she want to play with my business? Like, why she trying to, why she trying to, um, make my business look bad? Like, that's what I thought. I thought it was somebody doing that. But, it came to the conclusion that the girl was not talking about me. And then she made a video on her TikTok. I'm going to put the video in here too. She made a video saying, y'all, this is not the girl who I'm talking about. Stop going to her page, commenting, rude stuff, mean stuff under her stuff. And go show her some love. And then she ended up telling me, girl, I'm so sorry about all the confusion. This. The situation has been handled. My hair got done. My bank gave me my money back. So there is no need to try to hunt anybody down, find anybody, what have you. It came to my attention like 10 minutes ago that people are going after a stylist named Hair by Mari J on Instagram and Crystal, like hair, makeup, beauty, I don't know. That is not, none of those people are the stylist. Um, again, the situation has been handled, so please don't go directing hate to their pages. Um, in fact, please go show their pages some love because their comments are a hot mess. Now, I'm glad she cleared it up because she really couldn't have said nothing because I'm like a smaller like business or whatever and she got more like clout or whatever so she didn't have to say nothing so i'm glad that she addressed it on her tiktok so that people can stop like could stop like bashing me or whatever but she wasn't even talking about me in the first place she was talking about the other girl she had changed her original um instagram name okay she changed her original instagram name to something similar to my hair page name so that's why they got confused. But I'm like, this don't even, this not even the same. Like our name's not even the same. I don't know why they would even do that. But I'm gonna count this by hand. Oh, I need to tell y'all about the man. Oh, the man was telling me, hold on, before I count this, that man was telling me how you tired of making money. I'm like, I'm like, get out of my face. Like you're in my ear, it's loud music and I'm irritated and ready to go and you in my ear. So he like, let me let me you shouldn't you you belong somewhere else like you belong somewhere else you shouldn't be in here you sh you belong somewhere else this ain't you he like this ain't you you don't even know me you don't even know my name like what do you mean this not me you don't even know me how you know what's me if you don't even know me literally so he was like I can show you how to make some real money. Like I can, I can take you out the club. Like I just got out of prison for 20, 26 years, so I'm going nothing but up. <sighs> All right, you just got out of prison for twenty six years. You owe you're the strip club, and you tell the strippers that they shouldn't be here, and you finna go up. See, Mike, to me, you worry about the wrong thing. Oh man, yeah, he. 
that kind of blew me. And then he was in my ear like, I don't, like, you in my ear telling me BS. Like, okay, if you're going to tell me BS, tell me BS from afar. Don't be in my ear. Like, close. Like, I'm irritated. Okay, let me... Y'all, did I even tell y'all that today was Sunday? If I didn't tell y'all, today is Sunday. I don't know if y'all can see, but I put it in 50, so. Now, let's see what it is. We got 100, 100, another 100. Oh my God, three. It's like, y'all, do y'all realize my money count's been stuck in the threes? Like, what's going on? Yeah, it's because, I don't know, maybe it's just me. I need to um step it up. So next, next money count need to be, next week money count need to be more crazier than this because... I made 365 Saturday night. My goal is about to start being 500. Because I know I can do it, but I just be, you know what I'm saying? Chilly. But this is what I made 365 first Saturday. Thank y'all so much for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Y'all, now I started the vlog, I'm gonna start the video yawning. I'm so freaking tired. Okay, now now you can tell this a heart. Now you can tell. Kind of. Well, I can tell. I don't know if other people can tell. But, all right, y'all. I'm going to see y'all when I get in. This is my money so far. All right, y'all, this is my money from last night. I'm about to count it and then tell y'all how much it is. This is what I made for all the days that I've been vlogging.